Good afternoon, good morning, welcome to morning class, welcome to morning smart class and we will discuss our affairs. Which company launched first of its kind? Pilot project on flex fuel strong hybrid electric vehicle. Maruti Suzuki, Audi, Hyundai or Toyota? Answer is Toyota. Right. What do you mean by this flex fuel? Flex fuel strong hybrid electric vehicle. Flex fuel, flex fuel means? Flex fuel means battery plus petrol or diesel, right? So flex fuel, flexible in fuel, that is hybrid electric vehicle. So Toyota has launched fast pilot project on flex fuel strong hybrid electric vehicle. So D is the Answer. Government of India earned a record breaking figure from India's first ever 5G spectrum option. Selling how much of total spectrum? How much of total spectrum is, so is uh, sold by Government of India? It is spectrum 5G spectrum. 5G, 5G means 5th generation mobile technology. The speed will be around 10 to 20 Gbps, right? Very high speed technology and the government of India has sold spectrum of 71% of total spectrum are sold by government of India. Okay. Next, which of the state recently launched Kutikov Road Safety Awareness Education Project? Kutikov Road Safety Awareness Education Project. Which of the following um, state has launched it? It is Andhra Pradesh, Tamil Nadu, West Bengal, or Himachal Pradesh. Your answer is Kutikov. It is launched by Tamil Nadu government. Tamil Nadu government, the CM is MK Stalin. Right? Tamil Nadu government, CM is MK Stalin. Remember this Kutikov is regarding road safety awareness. Road safety awareness, Kutikov, that is Tamil Nadu and MK Stalin. Tamil Nadu has also launched the scheme CM Breakfast Scheme. CM Breakfast Scheme, it is also launched by Tamil Nadu government. CM Breakfast Scheme to provide breakfast to the school children, it is launched by Tamil Nadu government. Tamil Nadu government has also launched Inum Ijutum Scheme. Inum Ijutum Scheme. Right. Inum Ijutum Scheme. Inum Ijutum Scheme, it is also um, uh, it is launched by Tamil Nadu government, that is to in the, to bridge the learning gap, right? To develop the learning gap that created because of the COVID lockdown. That is why the Inu Vijutum scheme was started by Tamil Nadu government, right? So C is the answer. Okay. Which village is declared? Don't, uh, why West Bengal was in news? West Bengal was in news because it has total number of districts become 30 districts in, in case of West Bengal. And another thing is that. Uh, the world's largest world's largest world's largest religious monument it is going to be established in west bengal religious monument it is going to be established in west bengal right largest religious monument that is in west bengal that is in mayapur mayapur west bengal that is iskon headquarter mayapur where world's largest uh, world's largest religious monument is going to be established. Okay. Mm. 
नेक्स्ट नेम द टू इक ओके नेक्स्ट ओके नेक्स्ट हिमाचल प्रदेश व्हाट आर द स्कीम लॉन्च बाय हिमाचल प्रदेश एटलीस्ट गुजरात वाज इन न्यूज़ बिकॉज़ ऑफ श्रेष्ठ जी प्रोजेक्ट श्रेष्ठ जी प्रोजेक्ट राइट श्रेष्ठ जी श्रेष्ठ जी प्रोजेक्ट दैट इज डेवलपमेंट ऑफ हेल्थ इंफ्रास्ट्रक्चर श्रेष्ठ जी इज डेवलपमेंट ऑफ हेल्थ इंफ्रास्ट्रक्चर इन गुजरात राइट बाय द हेल्प ऑफ वर्ल्ड बैंक Walwar is developing the health infrastructure in Gujarat that is called as Shrestha G project, right? Okay. Next, Gujarat was also in news because of international India international bullion exchange. India international bullion exchange. Gujarat was in news exchange. That is why Gujarat was in news, right? That is in Gujarat. that bullion means huge quantity of gold and silver india international bullion exchange okay pm gatti shakti university pm gatti shakti university that is in gujarat sorry only gatti shakti university gatti shakti university that is also in gujarat in gujarat right gatti shakti university it is established in gujarat okay next uh, maldhari tribe Maldhari tribe was in news. What is Maldhari tribe? Maldhari tribe means they are present in in, in burning grassland. Maldhari tribe are seen in burning grassland that is in Gujarat region, right? Gujarat got burning grassland. Burning grassland is the largest largest grassland of Asia. Largest grassland of Asia. The sea that is burning uh, burning grassland. Where Maldhari tribe are seen. It is in Kos region of Gujarat. Burning grassland in the region of Kosh region of Gujarat, right? Um, where Asiatic lion lion is found. Remember, in Kosh region, Asiatic lion are found. They are in Kosh region of Gujarat. Kosh region is famous for Asiatic lion. So um, uh, that is uh, these are the regions. Uh, okay, these are Maldhari tribe in Gujarat. Okay. So moderate is in Gujarat. Twenty four to seven solar power village. What is the first carbon neutral panchayat of India? First carbon neutral carbon neutral panchayat. What is the first carbon neutral panchayat of India? First carbon neutral panchayat of India. It is Pali village. Pali village of Jammu and Kashmir. Pali village of Jammu and Kashmir. It is declared as first carbon neutral panchayat of India. Okay. That means total amount carbon neutral means total amount of carbon released to the atmosphere is equal to total amount of car carbon absorbed by the atmosphere absorbed by the carbon sink. Carbon sink means forest or plants. That is carbon neutral. Okay. First Amrit Sarovar. Who is first Amrit Sarovar? There is a scheme Amrit Sarovar scheme. That is seventy five pounds. Seventy five pounds in each district. In each district. Right. For rainwater, for rainwater harvesting, fishery, agriculture, seventy-five pounds in each district will be that will be constructed. Okay, so first Amrit Sarovar, it is Rampur village of UP. Rampur village, first Amrit Sarovar is Rampur village of UP. Okay, this is first Amrit Sarovar. Okay, what are the other scheme? There is a Vivan Sagar Sal, that is scheme of Jammu and Kashmir. What is that? John Nigrani. John Nigrani is the scheme of Jammu and Kashmir. That is grievance redressal mechanism of Jammu and Kashmir. Grievance redressal mechanism of grievance redressal portal of Jammu and Kashmir government. That is John Nigrani. Okay. Next question. Name the two Ukrainian regions that were recently recognized by independent uh, as independent. By an order from Russian president. It is Vinnytsia or Kherson, Kherson or Zaporizhia, um, Poltava or Chernyiv or Vinnytsia or Chernyiv. 
आंसर इज खेरसन एंड जापोरिजिया खेरसन एंड जापोरिजिया दीज आर द टू एरियाज अनदर टू एरियाज आर लोहानस्क एंड डोनेस्क लोहानस्क एंड डोनेस्क रीजन डोनेस्क डोनेस्क रीजन ऑफ यूक्रेन दीज फोर रीजंस खेरसन जापोरिजिया लोहानस्क एंड डोनेस्क दे आर दे आर डिक्लेयर्ड एज इंडिपेंडेंट बाय द रशियन प्रेसिडेंट व्लादिमीर पुतिन even during the war between in russia and ukraine lohans donetsk kherson and zaporizhia these four regions are acquired by russian people okay russia was also in the news because of sarmat 28 what was this sarmat 28 sarmat 28 it is uh, it is intercontinental ballistic missile icbm intercontinental ballistic missile sarmat 28 right it is it is a intercontinental ballistic missile very long range missile having a range of 11000 to 18000 km okay next what is Kam, which country kamchatka peninsula belongs to which country kamchatka peninsula kamchatka peninsula belongs to which country it is related to russia where this sarma 20 is tested Kamchatka Peninsula that belongs to Russia. Okay, name the two Ukrainian regions that are recently. Yes, this is how they are. Next question we will see. As per the commitment to reducing inequality index, reducing inequality index, reducing inequality index, India secured which region? Reducing inequality index. India secured 123 rank, reducing inequality index. 123 rank, India has um, uh, right. 123 rank, reducing inequality index. What is the global gender gap index? Global gender gap index. It is 135. Global gender gap index. It is 130, 135. Global gender gap index. See there is another uh, or NGO that is that publishes reports regarding uh, inequality. That is Oxfam report. Remember, Oxfam report is most authentic report regarding inequality. Oxfam report that is related to inequality in India or in the world. Oxfam report. Okay. Recently, Global Hunger Index was also in news. Global Hunger Index. What is Global Hunger Index? Global Hunger Index. it is of india it is 107 107 out of uh, global hunger index out of 121 countries very poor rank global hunger index right india is just above only india is only above afghanistan pakistan sri lanka bangladesh are better condition so far as global hunger index is concerned okay on what what are the parameters of global hunger index parameters are stunting wasting malnutrition especially stunting wasting and malnutrition right these are the parameters of global hunger index next is innovation index innovation was index what is what is our innovation index innovation index it is it is released by wipo world intellectual property organization Innovation index it is forty. Forty is our innovation index, right? It was eighty one then in two thousand five fifteen. It has improved dramatically, right? World Intellectual Property Organization Innovation Index rank is forty position out of one thirty two countries. It is released by World Intellectual Property Organization. World Intellectual Property. Intellectual property means, for example, copyright that is one type of intellectual property. you cannot publish a book that is written by another person or similarly in case copyright is book in case of book and music example for patent in case of your producing a medicine government will give you patent for 10 years for example so that you can produce you are the only country who will produce it and you will get the perfect patent because you have invented that medicine there are other type intellectual property right for example trademark trademark right 
trademark trademark means you cannot use the design trademark or industrial design and industrial design you cannot uh, industrial design right you cannot copy the trademark or industrial design of another country right another 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 company right you cannot produce similar you cannot same design uh, of mobile it, uh, like your apple uh, samsung cannot produce once it had the similar mobile likes apple and he paid a fine of 6000 crore right suzuki cannot copy a model of mercedes right these are trademark they have their industrial design they have their trademark or you cannot sell uh, a i mean you can you can you cannot create is yes, uh, for example detergent you can give a give the name of surface you will be arrested another thing is gi general geographical indication geographical indication it is recognized of a particular area a particular natural or man made product generally for 10 years geographical indication is given right that means like our in case of our samalpur sari or odisha rasgulla these are the geographical indication kandamal haladi these are geographic they have got geographical indication these all are intellectual property right so these wipo this uh, in world uh, world intellectual property organization they and they um, recommends the countries to develop their ipr or intellectual property okay next RBI is minimum capital requirement for setting up asset reconstruction company. Asset reconstruction company, how much the minimum capital requirement is required? It is 300 crore. Why is asset reconstruction company are, cre are created? It is to management of NPA, non-performing asset. Non-performing asset, NPA. Performing asset, asset, asset reconstruction company are created. Right. And they manage NPA issue of banks. They manage the NPA issue of banks. What is NPA? If a loan is not given its installment for 90 days, 90 days or 3 months continuously, then it, that loan will be declared as NPA, non-performing asset. Right? If banks are more than, generally private sector banks have around 5% of the NPA and the one public sector bank are around 8% of NPA. It's a, NPA means non-performing assets. Suppose those loans that are not returned by the debtors, those people who take a loan, they do not return the loan. That is 8%. 8% around that, no, that is NPA of a bank usually. That's why bank do not give loan without credential. Okay. So minimum capital requirement is 300 crore. And reducing inequality index is 123rd. Next question. Which company recently partnered with NIPL to facilitate UPI payments? To facilitate UPI payments across Europe. It is Nexi, Altos, Fabgemini or Worldwide. UPI payment in Europe, this is worldwide, right? UPI payment in Europe, it is worldwide. If you have any, any issue, any um, uh, decision regarding UPI payments is generally is taken by NPCI, it is the apex body. National Payment Corporation of India, it is established under 2007 Payment and Settlement Act. Payment and Settlement Act, NPCI is established, it is the apex body regarding EPI payment. National Payment Corporation of India, 2007 Payment and Settlement Act. And in the world line, world line will facilitate EPI payments across, the, across Europe. Which bank recently partnered, partnered with Book My So to launch Play Credit Card? To launch play credit card, which bank has partnered with Book My Show? It is RBL Bank to launch play credit card. IMF lowered India's GDP growth projection from uh, what percent uh, from what percent to 7.4% in 2023? Uh, okay. 
lower India GDP growth, it is lower to lower to 6.8 percent, right? Earlier it was 7.4 percent. Now IMF predicted it will be 6.8 percent. IMF and World Bank, these are Britain Euro institutions. They are established in 1945. Britain Euro institution established in institution in established in 1945, right? IMF helps in case of any balance of payment payment crisis, BOP crisis. BOP crisis crisis means if you don't have foreign exchange reserves, then IMF will give you loan, right? International Monetary Fund, Britain Euro Institution, all it is created as also with, uh, with World Bank in 1945 after Second World War, 6.8 percent IMF GDP growth, projected GDP growth for 2023. Okay, what is the theme of World Arthritis Day? See, you always see the language whenever you gets the question by theme. Theme means always try to understand the language. The language of a theme will be always like a slogan, right? Always like a slogan. So first, rheumatoid, rheumatic and musculoskeletal disease patients. Is it a slogan? No, it's not. It's, I mean, we are not. It is not a slogan. It's just talk about our patients. It's in your hands. Take action. It just seems like a sort of slogan. Time to work. It is a type of slogan. Don't delay. Connect today. But these are. It is regarding connectivity or some some communication. Time to work. It's not about work. World Arthritis Day. It is not about a particular work. If you observe properly, then this option is right. It is in in your hands. Take action. World Arthritis Day. B. Because in case of arthritis, exercise is most important. That's why it says that it is in your hand. So you work out. There is no medicines for proper medicine. So B is the answer. That is World. Arthritis Day, like right? when is World Arthritis Day? It is 12 October. 12 October is celebrated as it is observed, not celebrated. It is observed as uh, World Arthritis Day. Okay. Next. Which of the following points are incorrect with respect to the World University Ranking 2022 Indian Institution of Science IIC Bangalore in Karnataka has ranked one since many years IIC Bangalore is considered is securing rank one so far as the university world rank the world university ranking is concerned one among indian institution and also only university in india to make the top 300 list to make top 300 list IIC Bangalore is in the first institution it is right With hundred institutions included in the Dow World University ranking, it is seventh most represented country in the list. No, this is wrong. India is sixth most represented country. Sixth most represented country in the list. Oxford University is ranked first, right? After Oxford, then there is Harvard in the that is the United States, right? So one, uh, which of the following statement is incorrect? So B is incorrect. Two only is the Incorrect statement. So IIC Bangalore is ranked one, India sixth position, and Oxford University is ranked one among all the universities of world. Who is small finance man partnered with Paytm to deploy car services? Small finance man partnered with Paytm. It is John of Small Finance Man. John of Small Finance Man has partnered with. Uh, Paytm to deploy car devices. Okay.
who authored the book the philosophy of modern sum the philosophy of modern sum the book authored is by see magnus carlsen it is uh, philosophy of modern sum he is a tennis world champion sorry chess world champion is magnus carlsen right so it is not the answer the philosophy of modern sum the answer is bob dylan bob dylan has also got nobel prize in literature right bob dylan is a modern sum so answer is b the philosophy of modern sum not just a night watchman my not just a night watchman book watchman my innings in bcci my innings in bcci who has written this book it is written by vinod roy vinod roy vinod roy was former cag comptroller and auditor general of india under article 148 not just a night watchman my meaning my innings in bcci vinod roy cag 148 at uh, that is 148 right article 148 vinod roy he has written this book not just a night watchman who has written lockdown lyrics lockdown lyrics book lockdown lyrics book it is written by sanjukta das sanjukta das has written lockdown lyrics books right sanjukta das of odisha has written lockdown lyrics magic of mongol jodi magic of mongol jodi book who has written magic of mongol jodi book it is avinash khemka avinash khemka has written magic of mongol jodi book regarding mongol jodi of chilika right who has written ashtanga yoga ashtanga yoga book ashtanga yoga this book is written by sonu pohat sonu pohat has written ashtanga yoga right who has written a place called home a place called home is written by whom a place called home it is written it is written by priti sinoy priti sinoy has written a place called home okay next irdi has gave gave approval to march gave approval to march uh, what would i hdfc life it is excite it is excite life it has merged with irda it has it has merged with hdfc life okay see all the all the decisions or the uh, or the policy making all everything it is uh, by irda it is um, of insurance in india it taken by irda IRDI that is insurance regulator it is a insurance regulator of government of india so all these uh, ten decisions are taken by IRDI and IRDI is a independent statutory body IRDI is a statutory body independent statutory body it is established under irda act right insurance regulator development authority insurance regulator Develop development authority irda act of 1999 1999 irda act it is coming under the jurisdiction of ministry of finance irda insurance regulator development authority of india it is coming under ministry of finance 1999 it was established and it is a statutory body statutory body means those bodies which are created by act of a parliament they are called as statutory body okay so it is answer is excite life it has merged with sdfc life abdul latif rashid abdul latif rashid he is elected as the president of which country Abdul Latif Rashid it is the president of uh, um, he is the president of Iraq Abdul Latif Rashid 
elected as the president of Iraq. Okay. Iraq, Iraq is uh, who is the largest supplier of oil, oil supplier. Top, top most oil supplier is Iraq. After that, there is Saudi Arabia, the second oil largest oil supplier. Third is Russia. Right. These are the oil supplier to India. Who is the president of Israel? Israel president is Air Lapid. Air Lapid is the president of Israel. Israel was in news because of Barak missile. What is this Barak missile? Barak missile is the Barak missile is surface to air missile. Barak missile is surface to air missile. Surface to air missile jointly developed by India and Israel. India and Israel they have jointly developed Barak missile. Air Lapid is the president of Israel. Okay. Who was the president of Costa Rica? Costa Rica president Rodrigo Caves. Rodrigo Caves is the president of Costa Rica. Who is the president of Colombia president? Colombia president. Colombia president, new elected Colombia president, Gustavo Petro. Gustavo Petro is the president of Colombia. Who is Prime Minister recently resigned? UK Prime Minister recently resigned. Okay. Who is the president of Honduras? Honduras first female president. It is Xiomara Castro. Xiomara Castro is the first female president of Honduras. Who is the president of Philippines? Philippines president. Philippines president is um, uh, Ferdinand Marcus Jr. Ferdinand Marcus Jr. is the first for Ferdinand Marcos Jr. is the first he is the um, um, president of Philippines right uh, Shiovana Castro is the first female president ok Ronnie Wikimedia Singhe Ronnie Wikimedia Singhe is the president of Sri Lanka Ronnie Wikimedia Singhe Which district has got award in Swachh Sarvekshan uh, uh, Swachh Sarvekshan Gramin Swachh Sarvekshan Gramin Two thousand twenty two. It is Bhiwani district of Haryana. Bhiwani district of Haryana has got award in Swachh Sarvekshan Gramin. Okay. Largest employment is provided by which industry? It is by manufacturing industry provides largest employment. Best performing state in Swachh Sarvashan 2020. Best performing state. In Swachh Sarvashan. Best performing state in Swachh Sarvashan. 2022 it is Madhya Pradesh, right? Shivraj Singh Chauhan is the Chief Minister, Madhya Pradesh, best performing state. It is Madhya Pradesh. Next, which organization integrated cryogenic engine manufacturing? For example, yes, cryogenic. What is cryogenic engine? Cryogenic engine it is. It was in news. It is by hydrogen. Hydrogen is hydrogen fuel. Hydrogen fuel is used in cryogenic engine at minus 250 degrees Celsius in liquid state. Cryogenic fuel it is used in GSLV that is geosynchronous satellite launch vehicle. Geosynchronous satellite launch vehicle. Cryogenic engine is used. 
where hydrogen liquid hydrogen fuel is used in cryogenic engine okay fast tiger reserve in up in which area fast tiger reserve in up it is bundelkhand region bundelkhand region fast tiger reserve is going to be occur grand prix bharat grand prix bharat formula 1 racing grand prix bharat formula 1 racing it is going to be uh, going to be uh, in, uh, conducted at noida uttar pradesh noida up grand prix bharat will be conducted okay largest wind solar power plant largest wind solar power plant power plant that is going to be established in rajasthan jaisalmer rajasthan jaisalmer largest wind jaisalmer largest wind solar power plant is going to be established world's largest world's largest world's largest so uh, world's largest solar uh, floating solar power plant floating solar power plant world's largest floating solar power plant it is going to be established where it is largest floating solar power plant it is going to be established in mp largest floating solar power plant it is going to be established in madhya pradesh right perfume city which city is called as perfume city perfume city is kanauj of up kanauj of up is called as perfume city uttar pradesh perfume city kanauj of up it is perfume city okay next RBI recently cancelled the certificates of registration COR of how many NVFCs in India? Eight NVFCs. The yes, COR COR is cancelled of eight NVFCs. What is NVFCs? Non-banking financial company. NVFCs are non-banking financial company. non banking financial company their nbfcs non banking financial company these are companies established under companies act of 1956 companies act of 1956 remember companies act amended in 2013 right companies act of 1956 non banking financial companies they are remember their features is that the features of nvfc is that nvfc is that they cannot accept remember they cannot accept demand deposits nvfc cannot accept demand deposits and checks nvfc cannot have demand deposits and checks these are nvfcs non banking financial companies world bank recently extended how much unconditional loan for salt project of andhra pradesh government for salt project of andhra pradesh government world bank has it has uh, extended a loan of 250 million world bank is established in 2015 it has it is uh, sorry 2004 so it is 1945 world bank established along with inf it has five branches World Bank has five branches. It is also called as Britain Tour Institution. First bank was IBRD, Intellect uh, International Bank for Reconstruction and Development. That is called as IBRD. <coughs> yes, from the right, two fifty million dollar. Okay. <coughs> IBRD and second is Myga. Myga. third is ifc third is interest uh, third is ifc then ida fifth is icsid 
आई सी एस आई डी CIVID is in, is International Bank for Reconstruction and Development. Maiga is multilateral. Maiga is multilateral in guarantee agency. Multilateral guarantee agency. This is Maiga. What is the job of Maiga? It is insurance. It insure lender. It insure lenders. Job of Maiga that is insure lenders. Multilateral investment guarantee agency. Then. IDA is International Develop International Development Association. IDA International Development Association. It provides low or no uh, it, low interest loans. Low interest loan. International Development Association. Low interest loan to developing countries. Then I uh, then IFC International fin Finance Corporation. It provides investment advice. All these things. Uh, asset management to companies and governments. IFC it provides us investment advices, advices, right? It provides loan. I I T it also provides loan for I for developing countries. Then I C S I D International Center for Settlement of Invest Investment Disputes. International Center for Settlement of Investment Disputes. Remember, India is not a member of I C S I D. India is a member of all other four types, four brands of World Bank, but India is not a member of ICSID. Okay. Next. Who is the Chief Minister of Andhra Pradesh, Jagan Mohan Reddy? Which Indian Naval ship recently participated in IPSA 2022? It is INS Tarkas. INS Tarkas has participated in IPSA 2022. Okay, what is INS Gharial? INS Gharial. What was the why it was in news? INS Gharial. INS Gharial. It was in news because. It has it has transported medicines to Sri Lanka. INS Gharial it has transported medicines to Sri Lanka. Right. And Ipsa Mar. Ipsa Mar means it is the maritime exercise between Indian India Brazil. Brazil South Africa India IPSA Indian Brazil South Africa right maritime exercise between India Brazil South Africa it held at in it held at post South Africa this time it is held in South Africa location is at South Africa location South Africa if some are browsing only to maritime exercise, it's a maritime exercise. Right, maritime exercise. So A is the answer. INS Tarkas. Okay. Which of the following points are incorrect with respect to President of India visit to Assam? President of India visit to Assam. The President of India inaugurated supercomputer facility named as Forum Parul. At IIT Gohati. She also inaugurated Samir. She also inaugurated uh, Samir at the IIT Samir Laboratory at IIT Kohati. Fountains of stone laid by the president at two zonal institutes of National Institute of Virology to be set up in Dibrugarh and Jabalpur. 
C Param Parun, it is a, it is a super computer that is in NIT Tiruchirappalli, right? It is not in IIT Guwahati, it is at in Param Parun, it is a super computer. Param means super computer. Param Parun, it is, uh, it is at NIT Tiruchirappalli. NIT Tiruchirappalli, the Param Parun. That is super computer, right? That is, uh, it is in uh, NIT Tiruchirappalli. So first statement is wrong. If first is wrong, uh, so uh, question is which is incorrect. So only one is incorrect. Only one is incorrect. Rest all are two. All are true. Samir laboratory at IIT Guwahati. Samir laboratory at IIT Guwahati. And find Jolan Institute of Nest Virology. Institute of Virology is its set of it is the set of in Jibrigod and Jawalpur. Okay, India's first, India's first forestry university, India's first forestry university, it is, it is going to be established at Tripura. India's first forestry university, it is going to be established at Tripura. The CM of Tripura is Maniksa. Maniksa is the CM of Tripura. Maniksa. Okay. Tripura has launched a scheme. What is the scheme? Why it was in news? It was in news because of armed with lawn scheme. Armed with lawn. It's a scheme under Vidyalaya Chalo Bijan. Vidyalaya Chalo Abhijan. Armed with lawn scheme. Vidyalaya Chalo Abhijan. Right. Armed with lawn. Vidyalaya Chalo Abhijan. Okay. It is for dropouts. Those who are dropouts. Dropouts means those who have left their school just after 5 or 10 class, right? Without completing their classes, high school, they have left the school. These are dropouts. To bring back them, money is given. Armed with law. Vidyalaya Chalo Vijan. It is launched by Tipura government and India's first forestry university. That is also launched by Tipura government. Param Parulia supercomputer that is in NIT Kirchurapalli. PM Narendra Modi led the foundation of foundation stone of India's first bulk drug park in which, which state recently? First bulk drug park it is inaugurated in Himachal Pradesh. First bulk drug park. Bulk drug means huge industries of pharmaceutical products. Pharma companies. First bulk drug park that is in Himachal Pradesh. CM of Himachal Pradesh is Jairam Thakur. Okay. Next. UP was why UP was on news because of Panchamrit scheme. Panchamrit scheme of UP that is doubling farmer income. Panchamrit scheme doubling farmer income. Panchamrit scheme doubling farmer income. India's first petrol operated drone received type certificate from DGCA. Which was designed and manufactured by which of the startup? Fast petrol operated drone that is designed by Doxa Unmanned Private System Private Limited. Doxa Unmanned System Private Limited. These are drones. Who gives a certificate? DGCA, Director General of Civil Aviation. Any type of this airline permission, they are always given by Director General of civil aviation T is the answer okay that was general of civil aviation akas air akas air this are this is the airline that are given permission recently that is by dgc akas air airline 
that is who who was given it it is given by uh, who was the the in this it start up it was started by rakesh junjunwala rakesh junjunwala has started this who was a stock market investor he died recently he has started akasha air as a new type airline Okay. Which which state is going to establish rural industrial parks? Rural industrial parks. Which state will establish rural industrial parks? Or Gauthans? Gauthans rural industrial parks. It used to be established by Chhattisgarh government. Bhupesh Gavaghe is the chief minister. Chhattisgarh Chhattisgarh government. it will establish gauthans or rural industrial parks that is to provide employment in rural areas these are msme sectors okay these are msme sectors operation garuda who has started the operation operation garuda operation garuda is it is started by cbi against drugs right drug trafficking against drug trafficking cbi has started operation garuda against drug trafficking okay next who has authored the author the book tagore and gandhi tagore and gandhi walking alone walking together tagore and gandhi it is it is written by rudram sukharji रुद्रांशु मुखर्जी टागोर एंड गांधी वॉकिंग एलोन वॉकिंग टुगेदर रुद्रांशु मुखर्जी ओके थीम ऑफ वर्ल्ड रावीज डे थीम ऑफ वर्ल्ड रावीज डे इट इज rabies rabies one health zero death one health zero death this is theme of world rabies day rabies is a zoonotic disease rabies is a zoonotic disease zoonotic disease means those diseases which are transferred from the animal to human beings They are zoonotic diseases. World Rabies Day it is celebrated on, it is observed on twenty eight December. Twenty sorry, twenty eight September is observed as World Rabies Day. Twenty eight September, World Rabies Day. which institute recently signed mou with nhi dcl for cooperation in innovative solution for highways construction it is iit patna has signed for highway construction it has signed mou with nhi dcl what is this telemanus 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 it is regarding mental health telemanus scheme was launched by central government for mental health wait why because in case of mental health there is high under reporting under reporting means usually those people who suffer from mental health 
they uh, they do not inform this, uh, this this mental health condition to anybody and neither they go to the uh, neither they go to the uh, go to go to the um, doctors right or psychiatrist so tell me that is to head to that is for mental health mental health concern construction recommend uh, consultation tell me the four for which tell mental health assistance Tele mental health assistance and networking across states across states tele mental health assistance and networking across states right now c is the answer so c is the answer LIC reduced its stake in United Nilgiri Tea Estates Company. How much its stake was reduced? It is 3.98 lakh. Or 3.80 lakh or 4.1. 1 lakh or 4.2 lakh these 3.8 lakh shares it has been uh, it has reduced its share by 2 3.2 3.8 lakh shares right okay how many banks have signed MOU with Indian Army for Ognivir salary accounts Ognivir salary accounts it is 11 banks have signed their uh, agreement with Ognivir salary accounts right Ognivir salary accounts Sports portal. What is this sports portal? It was in news related to army. Sports portal. Sports portal. It is a portal that is pension related portal. Pension for ex servicemen. For ex servicemen pension by defense ministry. Right. Sports portal. Ex servicemen pension related portal for ex servicemen. Indian Air Force, remember Indian Air Force has started its new branch in Gujarat. Indian Air Force has started its new branch in Gujarat. Right? And Indian Railway will be net zero carbon emitter. Railway will become net zero carbon emitter by 2030. Net zero carbon emitter by 2030. PM scheme for mentoring young author. Scheme for mentoring young authors. This scheme was launched by Ministry of Education. Ministry of Education. PM scheme for mentoring young authors by Ministry of Education. Okay. Global forest outlook. Sorry, state of world's forest report. The state of world forest report. It is published by FAO and is Food and Agriculture Organization. Food and Agriculture Organization, State of World's Forest Report, Food and Agriculture Organization, 
FAO. FAO headquarter is at Rome, Italy. Rome, Italy is the headquarter of FAO. Food and Agriculture Organization. It it produces publishes a report that is State of World's Forest Report. What is DOX system? DOX. DOX is RBI supervisory system. Supervisory or monitoring system by RBI. That is DOX system. What is prompt corrective action? Prompt PCA. Prompt corrective action. PCA. Prompt corrective action PCA. It is basically it's RBA takes control of the bank. Takes control of bank of a bank when its condition becomes severe or slightly severe. Right? Regarding NP. If non-performing asset is increased, increased beyond a short-term limit, then prompt corrective action, that is made, all the major decisions will be regarding the banking will be taken by RBI. Okay. Largest unemployment, which state? Largest unemployment It's in Rajasthan Largest unemployment It's in Rajasthan Okay Which country is largest exporter of sugar Largest exporter of sugar is Brazil. Headquarter is at Brasilia, President is Bolsonaro. Brazil headquarter at Brasilia, President is Bolsonaro. Second largest exporter of you know, exporter is India. Second largest producer and exporter of sugar or sugar cane. Right? It is India. First largest exporter of largest exporter of rice is China. Second largest exporter of uh, second largest exporter of rice is uh, exporter of rice is India. Okay, what is Kalyani Empur? Kalyani Empur. It is armored vehicle. Armored vehicle of army of Indian army. Kalyani Empur. Armored vehicle. Faizabad Khan, its name changed Faizabad Khan Cantonment. Its name changed to Ayodhya Khan. Remember this cantonment area, they are governed by Ministry of Defense. Faizabad Khan, that changed to that changed to Ayodhya Khan. Name changed to Ayodhya Khan.
India's first FIFA, FIFA football for all initiative was launched in which state? First FIFA football for all, it is in Odisha. D. FIFA football for all. Right. Odisha was in news for first tribal health observatory. India's first tribal health observatory, it was established in Odisha. Odisha was in news because of Chhatta scheme. Right. Chhatta scheme. It is Odisha. Chhatta scheme. It is related to rainwater harvesting. Rainwater harvesting. Chhatta scheme. Rainwater harvesting. Chhatta scheme. It is related to Odisha. Right. Odisha was. It has got MSME award. Rank one. Odisha has got MSME award. And Odisha has got, got NFSA award. National Food Security Act Award, Odisha Secured Rank 1 in implementing National Food Security Act. National Food Security Act came in 2013. 13 Act of National Food Security Act. Right. In which 70, 75% of rural population were given rice, wheat and coarse grains and 50% of urban population. National Food Security Act, when you Food Security that's why Odisha was in news. Which city was honored as grand winner of the AIPS World Green City Awards? Bengaluru, Chennai, Hyderabad, Gandhinagar. Was honored as the grand winner of AIPS World Green City Award. World's Green City, it was Hyderabad. Hyderabad was honored as grand winner of AIPS World Green City. Okay, B is the answer. Okay, what is Operation Satark Railway Protection Force RPF? Operation Satark it has launched to control trafficking to control trafficking. To control trafficking, Operation Satar has launched by RPF. Right. Trafficking of drugs and women. Trafficking of drugs and women. Operation Satar. Okay. There are other operations launched by RPF also, like Operation Seva. Operation Seva that is also launched by RPF regarding service to the citizens during boarding and onboarding in railway. Right? Operation Seva is also by RPF. Right? Which cooperative bank license was recently cancelled by RBI due to insufficient capital? Insufficient capital, Seva Vikas Cooperative Bank. Seva Vikas Cooperative Bank, its, its uh, insolicitations was uh, cancelled by RBI. Okay. There is also Operation Dignity. That is why also I, Operation Dignity for adults. It is also launched by RPF. Operation Dignity by RPF for adult. That means Those adults who are suppose going away from their family or uh, le, suppose they have left their family, they are not uh, they are uh, finding them, right? Some are some are missed. The operation dignity is lost for them. Then operation Nanhe Fariste. Operation Nanhe Fariste is also launched by RPF. That is to help the children. Operation Nanhe Fariste. To help the children. Operation Matri Shakti. 
ऑपरेशन मातृ शक्ति दिस इज टू हेल्प प्रेग्नेंट वुमेन टू हेल्प प्रेग्नेंट वुमेन ऑपरेशन मातृ शक्ति वाज वुमेन इज ऑपरेशन मातृ शक्ति इज लॉन्च्ड टू हेल्प प्रेग्नेंट वुमेन दिस इज व्हाई रेलवे प्रोटेक्शन फोर्स आरपीएफ रेलवे प्रोटेक्शन फोर्स ऑपरेशन मातृ शक्ति which of the following personalities was recently appointed as brand ambassador of bold kauri private limited it is surya kumar yadav and saif ali khan they are appointed as the brand ambassador of bold audio private limited okay okay who is the winner uh, winner of formula 1 honda japanese grand prix it is max verstappen max verstappen it is grand prix winner max verstappen he has won Japanese Grand Prix, he has won Canadian Grand Prix, he has won French Grand Prix, he has won Miami, Miami Grand Prix, right? Formula One nation, Max Verstappen, he is also the sports person of the year. Okay, which countries have they have established international solar system? International solar system, sorry, international space station. ISS International Space Station. Which country have manufactured it or launched it jointly? It is jointly launched by NASA of 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 USA. Then Roscosmos, the space agency of Russia. Roscosmos plus JAXA, Japanese space agency plus European space agency. And the European Space Agency, Japanese Space Agency, and uh, Canadian Space Agency. These five space agencies they have uh, they have this constituted this International Space Station. It is a very big satellite that is uh, revolving around the Earth in LEO, low Earth orbit, around 400 to 500 kilometer distance. It is uh, revolving the Earth. Okay. Next. Which of the following points are incorrect? Ellen Aspect, John F. Clauser, Anton Jellinger, Nobel Prize in Physics. They have got Nobel Prize in Physics. Yes. Caroline R. Bartoji, Morten Meldon, K. Barry, Sarkles, get Nobel Prize in Chemistry. Ellen 
एलिस बैलेट्स की नोवेल प्राइज इन फिजियोलॉजी एंड मेडिसिन 2022 दस स्पेरिक्सेस रिसबैंक प्राइज ऑफ इकोनॉमिक साइंसेस मेमोरियल ऑफ अल्फ्रेड नोवेल टू बेन एस बर्न बर्न बर्नांग के डोगलास डबल डायमंड एंड फिलिप एस डाइविंग Which of the following statement is incorrect? Alias Balatsky. They have Nobel Prize in Physiology or Medicine. This is wrong. Physiology and Medicine. It is Swante Pavo. Pavo has got has got the Nobel Prize in Medicine. Okay. So C is the answer. C is the wrong answer. Which INS recently launched submarine launch ballistic missile? India's second strike nuclear capability. Launched. Submarine, submarine launch ballistic missile, India's second strike nuclear capability, INS Arihan, INS Satpura, INS Tarkas, INS Kalwari. It is INS Arihan, right? INS Arihan has nuclear. Uh, it has launched submarine launch ballistic missile. Ballistic missile means it will be thrown like this. Path, this ballistic path. Low accuracy than cruise missile. Cruise missile, example, right? Your Brahmas cruise missile. They have high accuracy, high accuracy and low range, not long range, short range. They are basically short range, short range. But ballistic missile, they have very long range, but low accuracy as compared to cruise missile, as compared to. Cruise missile, they are low accuracy. So INS, uh, so the submarine launch ballistic missile, that is your Sagarika, Sagarika, it is submarine launch ballistic missile, that is second strike nuclear capability. Second strike nuclear capability means somebody has attack, you will reply it. Who was recently appointed as a whole time member of the SEBI? Whole time member of Security and Exchange Board of India. It is Ananta N. Gopal Krishnan. Ananta N. Gopal Krishnan is appointed as a whole time member of Security and Exchange Board of India. SEBI is a stock market regulator. Right? Every decision will be taken by the SEBI. Every decision regarding stock market will be taken by SEBI. Or Security and Exchange Board of India. It is a stuff. It is become a statutory body in the 1992. Statutory body that is created by Act of a Parliament, SEBI Act of 1992. Ananta and Gopal Krishna is the lifetime member of SEBI. Next, which of the following points are incorrect with respect to National Games of 2022? The National Games of 2022 are held at Narendra Modi Stadium in Ahmedabad, Gujarat, for the first time with uh, 
first time with mascot Savage. Right, it is right. See, next time games in 2022, Max Savage is the mascot. Right, and it is going happened in Gujarat. The service teams under Aegis of Service Sports Control Board SS, SSCV SSCV Service Sports Control Board became winner of national games you know, for the fourth consecutive time, followed by Maharashtra. Tamil Nadu back the Indian Olympic Association IOA based stadium um, trophy for furnishing second of a medal tally, the most medals among the state, Puja Patel of Gujarat. Has become the first athlete to, uh, to win gold. Puja Patel of Gujarat, first athlete to win gold. Question is which of the following statement is incorrect? This is C is, is easy incorrect statement. The most important thing is that national game in 2022 it is happened in Gujarat and the mascot is Savage. What was the mascot in UK Birmingham? It is Hello India Youth Games. The mascot is um, it is Dhakar. Dhakar is a cow. Dhakar is a cow that is Hello India youth, youth Games that is that happened in Panchkula Haryana and the mascot is Dhakar. Dhakar is a cow. Okay. So these are the official mascots of different games. Next question is which state or UT recently launched application to keep track of Which is, yes, application to keep track of all ongoing offline projects in various departments. It is Delhi. To keep track of all ongoing and offline projects in various departments. Next. Which the following is correct with respect to appointment of new Chief Justice of High Court? President of India transferred Justice Pankaj Mithal, Chief Justice of High Court of Jammu and Kashmir and Ladakh as the Chief Justice of Rajasthan. Remember, Chief Justice of High Court of Rajasthan is Pankaj Mithal. They are asking questions regarding Chief Justice. You have to remember the Chief Justice of High Court, especially those who are in news. Pankaj Mithal is Chief Justice of Rajasthan. Justice Prasanna, Balachandra, Barale, Judge of Mumbai High Court, appointed Chief Justice of Karnataka High Court. Chief Justice of Karnataka High Court, that is Prasanna, Balachandra, Barale. Right. Justice Ali Mahmud Magre, Judge of High Court of Jammu and Kashmir. To be, to, to be the Chief Justice of High Court of Jammu and Kashmir and Ladakh. It is, he will be the Justice Ali uh, Mohammed Magre, German, the judge of the High Court, he will be the Chief Justice of High Court of German Kashmir Ladakh, Justice Ali Mohammed Magre. All the options are correct regarding the appointment of Chief Justices. Right? Remember the judges are appointed by Collegium system. What is this Collegium system? Collegium system is the um, uh, Chief Justice of India and four senior most judge of Supreme Court. Chief Justice of India and four senior most senior most judge of Supreme Court, they uh, they decide I and mean, they uh, suggest the names. They recommend the names to the president who will be the next judge, right? So they are appointed by collegium system. Right? That the college collegium is consisted of CJI and four senior most judge of Supreme Court. Which state government recently launched the first of its kind universal health insurance scheme, the Chief Minister of Health Insurance Scheme, that is Uttar Pradesh, Nagaland, Gujarat, or Assam? Recently launched first kind universal health insurance scheme. Universal health insurance scheme which was launched by Nagaland, right? Nagaland, what is news? You can solve this question by logic also. 
लॉजिक इज वाई बिकॉज सेंट्रल गवर्नमेंट हैज ऑलरेडी लॉन्च आयुष्मान भारत आज सेंट्रल गवर्नमेंट हैज लॉन्च ऑलरेडी आयुष्मान भारत प्रोवाइडिंग 5 लाख हेल्थ इंश्योरेंस स्कीम 5 लाख हेल्थ इंश्योरेंस आयुष्मान भारत देन ऑब्वियसली बीजेपी स्टेट्स दे विल नॉट इंप्लीमेंट अनदर स्कीम राइट बट नागालैंड हैज इंप्लीमेंटेड इट नागालैंड हैज इंप्लीमेंटेड यूनिवर्सल हेल्थ इंश्योरेंस स्कीम honey testing and laboratory honey testing laboratory was also in, by inaugurated in nagaland in Nagar, honey testing laboratory it is inaugurated by the agriculture minister in nagaland right why assam was in news assam was in news for scheme that like is schools on wheels schools on wheels it is launched by assam government Assam Chief Minister is Himant Biswas Sharma. Schools on wheels is launched by Assam government. Okay. Day scheme. What is day scheme? Doctor Ambedkar Center of Excellence. Doctor Ambedkar Center of Excellence. It is day scheme. It is launched by UP government to provide competitive coaching to assist student. to provide competitive coaching to ss student day scheme was implemented by up government right next an indigenous quadcopter consumer camera drone recently launched in global drone expo where global drone expo is conducted it is on chennai global drone expo that is this drone expo is conducted at chennai to showcase india's defense indigenization indigenization means how atmanirbhar defense system our defense ministry is that is to showcase in the defense who become the first indian woman to receive icc player of the month award for september 2022 icc player of the hour harman preet kaur Harman Preet Kaur and is the ICC Player of the Month award. First woman to receive ICC Player, ICC first woman to receive ICC Player of the Month award for September 2022. Harman Preet Kaur. NSGL recently acquired a stake in digital commerce platform. Okay, NSGL how much acquired stake in the digital commerce platform of ONDC? ONDC it is very famous right very important also why it is very important because it is a government platform ONDC that will give uh, that will give uh, chances to every small uh, businesses to uh, the opportunity to sell at in the online in the digital platform 5.5% 6% b is a 5.6% stake in the digital commerce uh, NSGL has acquired What is NSL to form open network digital commerce? Open network digital commerce. It's like um, it's like Amazon or Flipkart. Open network digital commerce is launched by government of India. So 5.6 percent stake was acquired by NSL. Okay. Next we will see some international bodies. Important international bodies. What are the international important international bodies? Just a Okay, International Energy Agency. International Energy Agency (IEA). International Energy Agency (IEA). It is headquartered at Paris, France. Paris, France is the headquarter. 
of International Energy Agency. It is established in 1974, right? Established in 1974. Why? Because after the oil crisis, oil crisis happened in 1973, Saudi Arabia stopped supplying oil for six months, oil crisis. After that, in 1974, it was established. What is the purpose? To ensure energy security. Energy security means so that whatever energy you require, you should produce yourself. You should not be dependent on a particular country, all these things, energy security. Right. India became associate member of the International Energy Agency. International Energy Agency Two thousand seventeen, Indus Energy Agency, India become associate member in two thousand seventeen. India become associate member of Indus Energy Agency. Right? There are uh, and recently another who joined Mexico joined. Mexico joined it, so total there are thirty members. In IEA there are thirty members. Where headquarters at Paris, established in nineteen seventy four. Next organization for petroleum exporting countries, OPEC. Organization for petroleum exporting countries, OPEC. It was established in 1960 by Baghdad Conference. Baghdad Conference, 1960, OPEC is established. Who are the initial countries? Iran, Iraq. Iran, Iraq, Kuwait, Saudi Arabia, and Venezuela, OPC 1960, right, where is the headquarter? Headquarter is at Vienna, Austria. Vienna, Austria is the headquarter of OPEC. Anybody can become the member of OPEC, but he should be a substantial exporter of petroleum products. If any country is exporting petroleum product in substantial amount, then he will be called as he, he can join OPEC, Organization for Petroleum Exporting Countries. Generally, they control the prices of petrol, petroleum products. Okay. Next is SARC. There are eight members of SARC. Afghanistan, Bangladesh, Bhutan, India, Nepal, Pakistan and Sri Lanka. These are eight members of SARC. Remember this Maldives is member. Maldives is also there. Maldives. Maldives is also there. Maldives, Sri Lanka. The Afghanistan, Pakistan, Nepal, Bhutan. Right? These are members of SARC. There are nine observers of SARC. Nine observers of SARC. Right. SARC was established in 1985. It was, it was established in 1985. SARC was established in SARC Charter in Dhaka. By SARC Charter in Dhaka. Dhaka it was established. What is the headquarter? 
Its headquarter secretariat is at Kathmandu, Nepal. Headquarter of SARC is at Kathmandu, Nepal. Okay. Next. Asian Infrastructure Investment Bank, Asian Infrastructure Investment Bank, AIIB, it is established in 2016, headquarter is at Beijing, Beijing China is the headquarter, AIIB Beijing China is the headquarter, right. Asian Investment Infrastructure Bank, then Asian Development Bank, Asian Development Bank, Asian Development Bank, it is established in 1966, 1966 it was established, its headquarter at uh, Manila, Philippines, Manila, Philippines is the headquarter of Asian Development Banks. It has total 68 members. 68 members Asian Development Bank, headquarter of Manila, Philippines. Okay. Asocham. What is Asocham? It is, it is a knowledge chamber of Indian industry, industrialists, knowledge chamber or pressure group. Established in 1920, it will, it will just share the industry concerns to the government of India, especially for commerce and industrial environment. This will give its recommendation, industries bodies, association. Then Competition Commission of India, CCI, Competition Commission of India, it is a statutory body, by Competition Act of 2002, it was established in 2002 by Competition Act, it is a statutory body. It was recommended by Raghavan Committee. Remember, Raghavan Committee has recommended Constitution Commission of India, Raghavan Committee. Recommended by Raghavan Committee. Okay. Important missions. Inside mission. What is was inside mission? It was launched by NASA to Mars. To Mars interiors to study. Mars interior inside mission was sent by NASA. Okay, NASA has has launched Veritas mission. Veritas mission and Da Vinci mission. That is to Venus. Venus in that that it is the mission Venus, right? In, in NASA will send to Venus, Veritas mission and Da Vinci mission. Okay. Indian India's Venus mission, that is Sukrayan. Sukrayan, it will go, that is mission Venus. This will be launched in 2024. 2024 mission Venus will be launched by India. Okay, India will launch this year Aditya L1. Aditya L1 mission was it will be launched this year. India's first, India's first indigenous solar mission. 
very important aditya l1 that is l1 means suppose this is sun and this is earth earth is very small in so there is a point at which total gravitational force between sun and earth becomes zero that is called as langrass point l1 is called langrass point langrass point is a point at which total gravitational force of earth becomes zero that is the um, force between earth and sun becomes zero that is langrass point okay next is gaganyaan it will be launched in 2023 first half aditya elwan mission it will study solar corona solar corona will be studied by aditya elwan mission then gaganyaan mission gaganyaan mission it is it is it is to it is to it is indigenous fast Indigenous means Atman River Bharat made by India, first time by India, right? Indigenous means generally it is started by India. This mission is by only by India. First indigenous manned mission that means first indigenous manned mission that is to it is uh, first indigenous manned mission. That is uh, no, that is to be launched, right? Three crew members will go. Ten thousand crore expenditure. They will go for six and five, six, five to seven days. They will go to low Earth orbit. Low Earth orbit means hardly four to five hundred kilometer distance. It is first manned mission. India had never launched its manned mission to space. Gaganyaan is the first manned mission to space. Another thing is important is NASA. NASA is also very important. That is NASA ISRO Synthetic Aperture Radar. NASA ISRO Synthetic Aperture Radar Right That is That will be jointly developed by NASA and ISRO This is a Earth Observation Satellite Earth Observation Satellite Right Earth Observation Satellite means It will observe various developments in Earth It can take clear picture of Earth surface at any time, at any time it can take clear picture of Earth's surface. That is NISA satellite. Okay. So, the lectures ends now. Like this video and share and subscribe to Bani. Thank you. Namaskar Pranati, thank you. You are writing everything. Very good, very good practice. Okay, have a nice day. Enjoy your Sunday.